Celebrate good times. Come on. <laughs> Aww. Adorable. This is like the best sim wedding ever. Everybody sit down. Enjoy. Hold a meal. Let's maybe get rid of this as well. I feel like this is a little bit in the way. There we go. How nice. Pearl in her Hollywood white dress. Oh, she hasn't even met Amethyst? How is this possible? Oh no, there's not enough seats for everyone. Okay, Gem, I really... How can she not know who Barbie is? It's her mother-in-law. They've definitely met. Let's friendly. We've got to. We've got to speak to mom. Come on, out of your chair, Barbie. Barbie, you've got to have a word with her. Oh. Okay, wait. Let's take a selfie. And then let's take a photo with Barbie. And then I feel like we need to take a photo with Mager. Oh no, he's got the chicken pox. That's so sad. Hmm, maybe Ruby and him get along strangely. Okay, there we go. Lots of pictures. Smile. <laughs> okay, and then of course he needs one with the missus. What a, what a place to have to have this event. Like, wow. Where is she? Where, wait, where, where is? Oh, little moment of privacy. I'm so sad that he has chicken pox on their wedding day. Like seriously, Jem, how could you? Why? <laughs> Ken gave it to him. Bobby would be absolutely furious. She'd be like, how could you give the son, chicken, your son chicken pox on his wedding day? Oh my gosh. Let's just have a little moment of making out. Can we woohoo anywhere in this place? Oh, poor Jem. Hug lovingly. Romance. Try for baby and bush. Is that our only option? Let's do it. Let's woohoo in the bush. They had such a classy wedding and then their, their baby making is in a bush. <laughs> <laughs> they just couldn't wait next to a bin. Oh gosh, these two love birds, love birds these days. Ooh, ooh, where's the bush? Oh, she's like, chase me, Jem. I want to take you somewhere as a surprise. <gasps> in the maze. Maybe he has to find her in the maze. That's so romantic. Oh my God, we're totally going into the maze. Ooh, ooh, it's all misty. It's like Harry Potter. H Harry Potter. She, she really is, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they're woohooing in the bush in this haunted looking maze. Oh my gosh, what a moment of romance in the Barbie LP. <gasps> you guys, it says no going into the bush as well. <laughs> oh my God, they're, they're woohooing in, oh my God, they're woohooing in the hedge. <laughs> Oh wow, you guys. Oh my gosh, and the whole family's still here. They're like, where did those two go up to? How romantic in this gorgeous maze at nighttime. Look at that bird's eye view. Ain't nobody gonna find them in there. And she got him to follow her. Such ex exhibitionists. Look at the fireworks go and make it a baby. I feel like they're gonna have a really good looking baby too. <laughs> Out through the hedge. Oh gosh. Let's have a little kiss. And the wedding's almost over. Oh wow. Okay, well where's, ah, I lost Diamond. Here she is. Okay, Diamond, let's thank you for coming and hug lovingly. And I also would like to get a picture with her because I just feel like necessary. 
Okay, here we go. Oh, she's like, congrats, Jim. I'm so proud that you finally found someone. I thought you'd be dating girls forever and you'd never settle down. <laughs> Look at the sass. She's so sassy and glamorous. She's so beautiful. All right, are we going to get a picture together? But there's only so much time, and there's so many family members. <laughs> Angie. Angie! That's nice. He's got such a good, like, baby face for how old he is. Look how similar they are. They're probably the girl and boy version of each other. I do think Diamond looks amazing with dark lipstick. Oh my gosh, Diamond, what are you doing between his legs? <laughs> Please. Oh, look at this. Oh, Amethyst has got a guitar out. Oh, this is family goals. Oh, I love this. Keep playing, keep playing. Oh, this needs photos for sure. What sweet memories. She looks awesome playing that guitar in her kimono-esque outfit. Oh, the family's leaving now, don't they? Lamassi. Lamassi learning her singing. <laughs> Selfies with one of the hosts. Oh, we didn't invite Amethyst, hubby. What's going on here? Onyx, do not go for Honey. Actually, we should get Jem to go speak to Honey. Give her just a nice compliment because it's probably really hard for her being there. And, you know, he he broke her heart. She wanted to marry Jem and marry into the Barbie family. Look at her looking into the window, wishing that she was a part of it all. And now the family's leaving and she's still there waiting. Maybe she'll turn evil and, like, try and kill Jem. That's a little bit far, I think. But Honey was nice. He's like, you look really nice tonight. Do a little bit of an inside jerk. Oh my gosh. Well, that's never going to happen. He dislikes her so much romantically. But they're friends. They're friends. So that's nice. Share a secret. Oh, hey. Hey, ghosty. Can ask how Maji is. Oh, they're good friends. I like that. She might cause some issues though if she gets too close with Jem's as friends. I feel like then Margo would feel really uncomfortable, understandably. So they're just friends. All right. Well, I think I'm gonna get these two lovebirds home. <clears throat> it's like remember the days when we used to play basketball? That was so much fun. Oh, Margo's gonna be like, um, Jen, what are you doing? Why are you talking to Honey right now? Oh, oh, she's giving her a word. She's like, he is chained to his wedding ring, Honey. She's playing games. But that was a stunning wedding. I'm so happy with how that went. I think that was just so nice and traditional and the family was there or most of the important people were there. So that was good. All right, so when they get home, let's have a look at the bedrooms because I feel like we need to get one of these bedrooms ready for a baby uh, because hopefully a baby's on the way. So we'll also need to get Margot to have a pregnancy test. Oh, fingers crossed they have conceived. Okay, yay. I think we'll just go straight to the toilet. Uh, and into bed. I think Margot should get up straight away and see if she's pregnant because I can't wait any longer. Take a pregnancy test. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Fingers crossed, you guys. Uh. Yay! Ah, she's got a belly. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Don't go to bed. Tell Jem the big news. Chat with Jem. Is she going to tell him the big news? Okay. He's so exhausted. It's three in the morning. Good wedding night. Let's see. I hope she tells him the good news. 
herself. Otherwise, we'll have to tell her Wimble to. Wimble Reginu. Yay! Nubu? Winubu! He didn't look that excited. He looked a little scared then. <laughs> Let's see if we can feel the tummy. Well, profess undying love firstly. I want to touch the belly. Maybe give a hug, because it's a big deal. We might have to get her to offer him to rub her belly. Uh, express fondness. Let's see. Deep conversation. Where is the option? Or maybe we have to wait until she's a little bit bigger. Well, becoming best friends, this is good timing for that. Yay! Oh my god, did you see a lazy eye go crazy just then? Oh wow, that was weird. <laughs> Alright guys, well let's get you into bed. And uh, I want to check out these bedrooms because we need to get ready for a baby. Come on, Gem, don't be like that. Go upstairs. Because we do have these two, uh, two bedrooms that are kind of already ready for a child. So we might leave this one as is. I'm just going to turn that off. Don't want to waste power and electricity. Uh, and they're joined by this bathroom here, which is really nice and spacious. Um, oh, I kind of like the pink room though. Uh, I don't know where, which room to turn into like a kid's room. And the good thing is there's plenty of room for the bassinet here. So I think what we'll do, uh, maybe we should wait until the baby is born. Oh, congratulations on getting married to Margot. I hope you two are very happy together. Thanks, Dominique. That is very sweet of you. I think, I think, I think, I think. No, you know what? We'll do a little room renovation for a toddler. We'll renovate this room because it's quite neutral right now. Uh, so let's just get a couple of toddler things in here. Uh, let's go to kids. Where are we? Okay, let's go with... Ooh, I love the green. The green is a little bit of fun. Let's go green. I know green and yellow sometimes is a bit cringe, but for a kid's room, let's just have a little bit of fun, shall we? Okay, so we've got that. Maybe we'll put these nice balloons on the wall. Just like that. And we'll just put a toddler bed in here. Uh, <laughs> green toddler bed. Which one's going to actually work? Oh my gosh! I feel like we're going to have a girl. I'm calling it now that we're going to have a girl. So, that way we can have purple and green color scheme. Slay. Imagine if we had twins, but they've already conceived, so I doubt it. We need to get a little potty in the corner here. And yeah, I've just decided we're having a girl. We're totally having a girl. That's what's happening. I won't take a boy for an answer. Uh, and we can probably fit in, just get the Wabbit tablet. Uh, and we'll need a high chair. I don't think the high chair needs to be in here though. We can put that high chair upstairs in the kitchen perhaps. So toddler can eat with them. Loving the pink and the turquoise to go perfectly with that carpet. That's kind of nice. Okay, let's put that like that. Cute. And then what should be in the middle of the curtain? Some kind of nice painting, I feel. I feel I need something like... Uh, what would a kid want? Butterflies? Let's hope it's a girl, otherwise we're going to change this whole room. Which I don't mind changing the room because I love building in The Sims. But that's better. I think that's definitely more toddler friendly. But we can make some extra changes once we get down to it as well. Work for Margot starts in an hour. Uh, trust in your pad in hand, it's time for work. Uh, she can just be sent to work. I don't think we need to go to work with her. So that's good. She's... Oh, she didn't get to eat anything. Sad times. And Jem. Oh my gosh, look at her in her science uniform with her pregnant belly. Off to her first day of work. Oh, kind of a bad time to be pregnant. Oh, it's time for work right now. Okay, they've just gone to work in the worst moods ever. 
I'm just gonna go check now on the Barbie dream house. Okay, now we're back to the Barbie dream house and I absolutely love this house. I'm just obsessed with the Versailles aesthetic about it. Like, oh, I just, I love it. I hope you guys like it just as much. I think you guys do. I, I read a lot of positive feedback, but I just think this is so, I don't know, where would you see a place like this? In Beverly Hills or somewhere? Okay, and it looks like Ken's already loving the new house, which is good. I get, I get, you know what? He's probably absolutely thrilled that his eldest son, Jem, just got married. And I think it's time for him to get into his gardening phase. So let's purchase some seeds. Let's purchase seeds. Uh, well, we're going to need quite a few. So let's get one of everything for starters. Uh, and that should be okay. Now we need to open up. All of these, open the seed packet, open the seed packet, open the seed packet, and open the seed packet. Okay, where should we plant the first ones? I think we should plant them over here first and then we'll work our way around. Um, but we'll put some strawberries in there, apple there, grape there, banana there. Uh, and then we can plant some different flowers in this one. I was kind of thinking we might try and keep carrots in one, strawberries in one, so we'll gradually add to them as we plant more. Uh, we might put another apple. Actually, you know what? Let's put the apple trees over there. This is gonna be organized, you guys. Put shrooms there. Mm -hmm. Spinach there. Oh, we got another flower. And then these ones can go there. There, there, uh, and there. You know what? We're probably going to need a professional gardener as well to help us out. So let's get that service. Uh, hire a service. I love that he looks so happy. <laughs> uh, scheduled gardening service. He needs fedora. He looks fabulous in his new clothes. Onyx, you're looking very fine. Okay, now let's get him uh, to start gardening. Let's plant these. Plant, plant, plant. I think he'll just plant some. Uh, the kids are late for school. Let's just take a take a vacation day at school. And let's have family planting day. Yay! Everyone can take a school vacation. And everyone can plant something. Oh no, kids can't plant. Actually, you know what? You should just go to school. Go to school. <laughs> the kids can go to school because they're not useful right now. Uh, go to school, please. And Bobby, what is what even is Bobby doing? Let's get you out here, Missy. Okay. Oh, look at Ken in his in his cute little outfit. Everyone helping out. Well, Onyx is helping out, which is good. Is he only gonna plant one? He's like so not into the outdoors, is he? Okay, our new gardeners come as well. So let's say Linda is teaching the family all how to garden and they're having a family garden day. So let's change your outfit, Barbie, into something a little less intense. <laughs> we'll put her in her white pants, perfect for gardening. Okay, yay! Beautiful. It's a shame that the family's still in their wedding clothes. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, let's change our outfit to something a little more laid back. And Pearl, I'd really like you to do the same. Something a little more laid back for you, Missy. Put you into my favorite one. There we go. That's better. Plant that. See, when you have everyone helping out, it's a lot easier. Bobby, what are you doing? <laughs> you should be helping. Bobby can water the plant. She doesn't like to get her nails dirty because she just had a manicure. You guys. Oh, cute. Ken's so proud of himself. He's like, that's right, kids. We're now going to have a family farm. Oh. Excuse me, Onyx, please calm down. It's finally coming out of his shell. It's parent Onyx. Discipline, calm, strict, yell out, yell at? I don't know if he would yell at Onyx. 
Maybe he's so into his pristine and nice gardening that he's like, Onyx, this is my zen time. Do not disturb my zen time. If I'm in my man bath or I'm gardening, this is zen time. Pearl's like, gardening with the fam. Hashtag fam life. Hug lovingly. Oh, you guys, so cute. What is with Barbie's face right now? She's so bored. She like has no care in the world about Ken's new garden. Oh gosh. Maybe we should get some more plants and everyone can continue helping. Okay, Ken, let's buy more. We need more plants. Okay, purchase, purchase seeds. Let's get more of these. One more of each. Oh, look at these girls having a nice, a nice chat. Barbie does look so bored, oh my God. Open seed packet, oh, no. open seed packet. Ugh, and open that. Okay, so what have we got so far? So our apple trees were over here, right? Yeah, so our apples can go there, can plant that. What's over here? This is strawberries. Do we have any more strawberries? Oh no, we didn't get any strawberries. Okay, parsley. That's basil. Parsley, we can put those in. Kids, we haven't finished gardening. Plant that. Plant that, get on the floor. Plant that, give me some more. Mm -hmm. uh, grapevine. Da, 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 the grapevine. <laughs> honey, honey. Okay, uh, grapevine, strawberries. Okay. Carrot. Put another carrot plant over here. Onyx, do you want to help with that one there? What's he doing now? He's like, come see my garden, Bobby. It looks so good. What are those? Spinach. Got another spinach to plant. Uh, yeah, I think, gosh, we're gonna have like such a good garden. This is the positive part of having so many family members <laughs> is that we have a lot of hands on board to help out. We took days off school. I don't understand why all the kids are gonna get in trouble still. <sighs> Ooh, we have a UFO fruit object. Better plant that. Don't mind if I do. Okay, we've got a lot of planting to do here. Uh, are these all of our flowers? Yeah. Well, we kind of tried to keep it neat, but I feel like we kind of failed at the same time. <laughs> uh, unidentified flower. May as well plant those too. Okay, who has stopped helping? Oh, she's really busting. Okay, that's fine. Use the toilet, then do that. Onyx is in a pretty good mood. Uh, can Kenny even plant these? Attempt to identify. If we identify it, can then can we then plant it? Oh, this garden's gonna look so pretty. Ken is still wanting to play dolls. My goodness me. Oh my goodness. Pearl looks so cute with her watering can. Love it. <laughs> she kind of suits this. All right, Ken, I think you've done really well with your gardening. Absolutely slaying it, life. That's good. I'm glad we got to just check up on the fam and plant a few things. I think we'll do some more planting later on. Um, but for now, you know, we've got a bit of the garden started and then we'll fill all of these up too. Let me know if you have any tips for what you want to plant or for upping that skill and it looks like barbie's being a domestic house <laughs> domestic goddess <laughs> domestic housewife in her new kitchen i think it suits her very nicely this new cottage kitchen and someone actually commented i think this would be ken's kind of style of kitchen and you know what i agree hey hey flint don't you look fab today fabulous Anyway, you guys, I think I'm going to leave this part right here. Uh, I did a double recording, so you would have noticed in the last part and this part, there was no intro. Um, but yeah, I just had so much fun. So thank you for joining me. I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are in the world. I will speak to you soon.